Bag up, bag up. Bag up, Terry. Put it in reverse, Terry. Put it in reverse, Terry. Put it in reverse, Merry Christmas, you filthy animals. Good morning, Ephrata. My name is Drew. My name is Natalie. Today is Thursday, December 5th. Please rise for a moment of silence and a pledge to the flag. Oh, <laughs> one day, only one day left to sign up for one of the best clubs at EHS, the Ski and Snowboard Club. I said it right this time. The deadline is tomorrow, so get your $50 deposit to Mrs. Brimhall in room 226. If you already signed up, don't forget to return your paperwork to Ms. Brimhall. The deadline for CTC applications is swiftly approaching. December 20th is the deadline for the application to be completed. You can go to the EHS Council website to re or refer to SchoolG message for a link in the instructions. If you have any questions, please see your counselor for help. Now over to Zach Gaiman for the thought of the day. Yeah, for my name is Zachary Gaiman and I have the thought for the day. Today's thought for the day comes from Theodore Roosevelt. Theodore Roosevelt lived a very inspiring life. Born with asthma, he was very weak, but he worked extremely hard to overcome it and become the war hero and president that we all know and love today. With that said, Teddy has many inspiring quotes, but one of my favorites is, believe you can and you're halfway there. This quote is inspiring because it reminds us that we tend to hold ourselves back by doubting our, our abilities, but if we believe in ourselves, we can accomplish most things. So next time things get, get tough, remember to simply just believe in yourself and it will get easier. Have a good day, Ephrata. Did you forget to order your yearbook? Yep, I bet. Well, now is a great time to remind you, <laughs> to you parents, that this is the last chance to purchase a book with personalization on the cover and the last chance at a discounted rate. Go to jostensyearbook.com to order it before it is too late. Sorry, Trevor's laughing at me. Now over to Riley with the news. In today's news, it's a little slow in the studio, so we're going to be talking about a tree. The Rockefeller Christmas Center tree went up last night, covered with Christmas lights and ornaments galore. The Norway spruce is more than 60 years old. It could probably qualify for Social Security, but, like, for trees. On this day in history, five U.S. Navy Avenger torpedo bombers disappeared over the infamous Bermuda Triangle. Since the disappearance of Flight 19, rumors have been perpetuated that sinister activities are happening in the Triangle. Like aliens and stuff. Now we're the juniors with lunch. Hey guys, I'm back. You know what time it is. It's lunch time. I know y'all been waiting to hear that. So we're gonna get right into this saucy little boy. Hit you with that little saucy meatball sandwich with the Maz. Uh, we got buffalo chicken panini. An Arsa grilled cheese panini. That's two paninis. That's a lot of paninis. Uh, barbecue bacon cheeseburger. French bread pizza. Italian hoagie. Crispy chicken salad. Fruit and yogurt parfait with a muffin. Toss salad. Seasoned sweet potato fries. Refried beans. Broccoli cal mm, cauliflower salad. Applesauce, fresh fruit. Slushy. EA Sports. It's in the E. Uh, yesterday, bowling was postponed versus Hempfield. <laughs> Today, there's nothing. There's no matches at all. Now back to the main desk. The main chair. <laughs> it's time. It's time to go nuts. Oh wait, oh wait. It's it's time to go nuts for donuts. <laughs> That's right. Head for the student council to run its annual Christmas charity to benefit six local families this holiday season. And with everyone's help, we can make this a very special Christmas for these wonderful families in need this holiday season. Your homeroom teacher has kindly picked out an ornament <laughs> with a gift on it. Your job is to raise enough money to buy that gift together as a homeroom. The homeroom that raises the most money, buys the most gifts, or does any co combination of the two will receive a deluxe donut party on the last day of school before Christmas break. A deluxe donut party has all the fix-ins from hot chocolate to donuts to Christmas cookies to coffee to bagels to few you get it. What about cheeseburgers? No, no. Um, and it's enough for the entire homeroom. 
The runner, the runner-up homer will receive a regular donut party, which is just donuts. Third place will receive high fives from future president of the United States, Mr. Marzok, because that is a totally worth gift. You can't just get that for free already, and it's totally better than all the other prizes. So bring in some loose change, bring in a gift, or do both, and help out some local families this holiday season. That's it. That's it. For have, us. A, have a great day. <laughs> zoom in on me! Zoom in on me! Zoom in on me! Zoom in on me! Oh. oh. So do you think you get for it? Yes, the show is with us in my fight. Very kind Friday. Get the camera off of me. Why, dude? You're very surprised. I feel your blood. You can thank Kevin McDonald for that. Kevin's going to close it. That is the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Oh, yeah, you didn't wait. Lawrence! Made the blood of the sheep. Wallace, get out! Do you believe in the lies of society? Bananagram. I smell kids who no process. I'm really good. Oh, my record should be right now. Please follow us on Instagram or Facebook for attention. It's that time of year again. Light and sound. Good morning! Don't ask me why. It just works. You already know what's up. Wow! If you hear... Why buy me sandwich? Oh, hey. I'm